Welcome to the Payments Race, where five plucky pioneers are on the adventure of a lifetime to reach their final goal and be crowned the Payments Race Champion. Each racer is only allowed to use a single form of payment for the entirety of the race. What will it take to make it to the finish line in Amsterdam? Find out in the Payments Race. Hey everyone, I'm Nina, coming to you from the Asian side of Istanbul. Very excited, but i uh, got my eye out on Augustus, that guy, he's done this before. Well, my plan for the race, I couldn't tell you that really, actually that's a secret, but there's some countries I know very, very well indeed, and some that I don't know very well, that's all I'm going to say. I'm going to be going from Istanbul, making my way to Amsterdam for the Money 2020 conference. Definitely nobody takes NFC, so good luck with wearables. <laughs> you ready? Yes. Ready! Woo Three, two, one. <laughs> There is no rule that says we can't collaborate. So with that in mind, Val and I are going to try and collaborate and get to the airport together. So we're going to try and see if we can use a water taxi, which is regular taxi, to get back to the other side of Istanbul. Yes, welcome. First thing I'm going to do is get the train out of Turkey. Because I've noticed international flights are a lot more expensive before you leave Turkey. From Bulgaria, possibly pop over to Greece, uh, then maybe through to Venice, maybe to Paris, have a glass of wine near the Eiffel Tower. I may even make a trip back to the UK. Just gotta find some cash now, so I can actually get that train. What we're gonna plan is try to look at all these amazing travel agents that accept cryptocurrencies and find one that is amazing. I've got a pretty good idea of which one I'm going to use for future travel. So we've got, we've got a meetup to go to. Uh, there's a FinTech meetup and People would like to meet me and I would like to meet them, so trying to figure out how to get there. Three, two, one. Oh, you have to transfer him. We want to go to the airport, but we can only pay Apple Pay. But only Apple Pay. Apple. No. Okay, that's not going to work, right? Okay, thank you. So, like, work a contract like this? Like this? Okay. Beep? Beep? Ah! Okay. Beep! You sure? We can use beep! We can use can beep. Test it? It's know. beep. Contactless is beep here. We can use beep. It's very, very poor. So, we need multiple t shirts. We're hoping. So sweating that um, this will get us to the airport, the Ashtuk airport in Europe. Or did we specify that that was the airport? Okay, so I am walking around and trying to find someone who could help. Excuse me, hello. You have Bitcoin? I know Bitcoin. Yeah, I yeah. know Bitcoin. Oh, do, you have, do you? I have some. <laughs> you have some? I bought some, yes. <laughs> Oh, and 350, yep. So, so far, I haven't had an issue paying cash at all. Just sat down now in somewhere called the Heyhitat, which is like a cafe uh, on the um, Istanbul front. Gonna have a smoothie, use the internet for a bit while I wait for the train. <laughs> the only word in this thing 
I can read this mango, so I'm just gonna have to have a mango. Mango's a good one, yeah. Okay, so we just went for, for that event. That was that was good. I mean, I'm glad people want to come see me. I'm not sure why. I'm not very interesting, right? We got a bunch of people and we actually got a whole room of, uh, of the guys from the, of the Orange Lab to endorse mobile payments. So that's endorsements at scale. I'm hoping to get more of those. So now what we're going to do is we're going to book our flight out, the first one available. And that's going to be... Uh, looks like Turkish Airlines, 7 a.m. 7 a.m. We're gonna be out of here and we're gonna be Budapest because we have another group to catch. So we've decided to head to Vienna tomorrow morning. Now that just means that we have a lot of downtime. So uh, we're gonna have about eight hours to kill, or sorry, eight hours, 12. Ooh, whole half a day, kind of lost. But um, I think in the end, it will work out for the best. It's cheaper and it's a bit further along. We're gonna go with it. I feel good about Vienna. Vienna, I'm coming for you. So, so they don't take contact with payments um, at the airport. At all. Nope, not no one. No one takes contact with. They have. They need a physical card to insert into the machine. So I'm gonna have to try and get some sort of train from somewhere, and we'll have to try and, and see if we can get to our next destination. Then wherever that's gonna be, Paris is probably not gonna happen um, without flying there. So I think okay, we have to get so. on the laptop and start uh, right. start figuring it out. Here is my bed for tonight, and it's actually a proper bed. I'm here in the Istanbul to Sofia train, so I'm on the way to Bulgaria. I've got a proper bed. There's bunk beds here, but no one's in them, so I get to stretch my feet right up there if I want to. And it's going to be a lovely, lovely night. So far, I haven't had any issues with cash. The only issue I had really was a bit of a language barrier early on, but other than that, it's been plain sailing and so far touch wood there's been no hiccups so i'll see you tomorrow for another episode of the payments race <laughs>